Hello, this is Mr. O.C. Banks from Rosaryville Elementary School. To help our awesome parents and scholars, here is a quick tutorial that answers the question, how do I get to Google Classroom? Let's get started. Step one, in your internet browser, go to www.pgcps.org. Again, that is www.pgcps.org. Once you are there, the Prince George's County Public Schools homepage will appear on your screen. You want to then locate the Gmail hyperlink at the top of your screen in the navigation pane. Here we have options about academics, alumni, board, schools, Gmail. You want to click right here on Gmail. Please note that if you are using a cell phone, such as an iPhone or Android, or if you are using an iPad or a tablet or the like, your screen may not look like this, but that is okay. If your screen does not pop up like this on your mobile device, just click on options and then scroll down to click on Gmail. You can still access this from your cell phone, iPad, or tablet. Step two, log in with Prince George's County Public Schools credentials. After you have clicked on the Gmail link from the PGCPS homepage, it will bring you to the Prince George's County Public Schools Google Mail webpage. Be sure to enter your student's PGCPS username, enter their password, then press log in. Step three, Welcome to PGCPS Gmail. After you have logged in through the PGCPS Gmail page, it will bring you to your child's PGCPS Gmail account. This is what your student screen will look like when they log in. After you have logged into Gmail, you're going to do step four. Locate the Google Apps Launcher. Go to the top of your screen. And over here next to the question mark and next to the PGCPS logo, you're going to find this icon, which has nine dots in it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is called the Google Apps Launcher. Click on it. Step five, select Classroom. After you have clicked on the Google Apps Launcher, you're going to come down here and select the Classroom icon. Step six, welcome to Google Classroom. Step seven, join a class. There are two methods to joining classes on Google Classroom. Let's begin with method one. In method one, the Google Classroom screen will look just like this, or kind of sort of like this. If your student's teacher has already invited them to join a class, just find the class and click join, just how you see here. If your student's teacher has already invited them to join a class, just find the class and click join. Now for method two, this is for those students who have not been invited to the class on Google Classroom just yet. This is how you join. Step one, you're going to click the plus sign at the top of the screen next to the Google Apps Launcher. Click the plus sign, then click join class. Once you click join, step eight, welcome to your virtual class. You are now free to move about the cabin. I'm sorry classroom as you please. Congratulations, you have made it inside of your students' Google Classroom. Hey, pay attention. We are not done yet. Here are some remote learning tips for Prince George's County Public Schools students and families created by our technology training team. Here are some weekly reminders for our students. Check Google Classroom daily, watch recorded or live meetings, ask your teachers questions, and turn in your assignment. We have now reached the end of our Google Classroom tutorial. 
It has been my pleasure to serve the wonderful parents and awesome students of Prince George's County Public Schools. If you need any help, please do not hesitate to reach out. Again, I am Mr. O.C. Banks, and thank you for joining me for this Google Classroom tutorial.